<laughs> and I was about to leave out an important several announcements or discussions. Uh, I guess it was about 12 years ago I heard uh, a president say, well, you know, it's just been one of those presidencies. And uh, today has been like, well, you know, this has just been one of those days. Uh, the generator on our food truck blew out, and it meant that even though they could get here, there wasn't any way that they could prepare food. And so we have sent out for pizza, uh, and it's not quite a replacement for burritos tacos and burritos, but uh, if you get pizza, we're going to ask that maybe if you feel like it, you don't have to, but to give a donation uh, of $2 or so, I guess, per slice, uh, as you're on your, on your way out. Uh, also, uh, about, this has really been one of those years, would you say that is one of those weeks, like, who has ever heard of two hurricanes at one time? Uh, and the same thing with the COVID-19. Who would think that we would have to stay, stay 12, I mean, not 6 to 10 to 12 feet away from each other? Um, but something happened. One of the contestants was exposed to a COVID-19 infectee. Is that the right word? She doesn't feel good. She likely has a fever, and she's not going to be here tonight. Another uh, finalist, uh, because of the virus, well, not because, but unexpectedly had a job offer that they couldn't refuse in Kentucky, and they left uh, uh, from Swanee County and had to move to, to, uh, to Kentucky quickly. And they are going to perform, this is a one-time thing only, because normally the people have to be here, you know, the contestants have to be here, but, the, but this person is, did not want to fly because of fear of being exposed to COVID-19 and then passing that along to the children and his family. So this is unusual. We've, we've tested it out and it looks like it's going to work.